Hey, what's going on you guys? It's Chris here, back with another video, and today I'm going to be reviewing the new movie Splice. And this is the latest new film to come from Vincenzo Natalie, the Canadian director who did Cube back in 1997. He did two more flicks after that, Cypher in 2002 and Nothing in 2003. And I got to see it this past Saturday, Waterford Cinema, 1045 showing. I don't know if you can see it, but there you go. Which is awesome. And this is the story about two scientists named Clive and Elsa, and they specialize in splicing together different DNA from animals to create these hybrids. And they want to take it to the next level and try to use human DNA in their experiments, but they get stonewalled by their bosses. So they go under the radar and conduct their own experiments in splicing human and animal DNA. And the result is a creature who they call Dren. Elsa is excited about the creation, but Clive is not too sure about it. They later discover that it's growing and learning at a fast rate, and weeks later it becomes a fully grown adult female with wings and a tail with a poison stinger. And these two scientists begin to ponder their decision as they try to understand and observe the creature, which they don't know of the things that it's capable of doing. I'm not going to give too much away here, but this is probably the most original sci-fi movie I've seen this year so far. Sure, there are obvious influences and inspirations in this flick, but somehow this manages to hold its own identity. Uh, Vincenzo Natalie has just such a great visual style, if you may. Just like he did with Cube years back, he has some very... This movie has some very good, well-done CGI effects, probably the best I've seen in a long time. Uh, makeup effects were also top-notch as well, which was awesome. Adrian Brody did a good job in this flick. Sarah Polly is always, uh, always great to watch on screen. Uh, David Hewlett, who you know from Cube, does a great job in this flick. He plays their boss. He has a small role, but it's still just as memorable nonetheless. And the real breakout star of this film, in my book, is the actress who plays the adult Dren. Her name is Delphine Chenaic. I hope I'm saying that right. She's a French actress. She's extremely beautiful, and she gives such a great performance in this film. You just got to check it out. For those of you who are into Vincenzo's work or just in the mood for some good, weird, original sci-fi, I strongly recommend this flick. If it's playing in your area, I urge you to go see it. Go Go seek it out and just give it a chance. It's it's quite an interesting experience, but a rewarding one for those who like these types of films. So go check out Splice, folks. And that's my little vlog on this movie. I hope you guys are having a great day. I hope you like this. And, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.